Alright, welcome to Queen of the Ring, week 5. Not that many weeks left. With 2K19 coming out. Some screenshots that have come out already for 2K19. Uh, look pretty good. Um, Velveteen Dream looks amazing. His entrance looks amazing. Um, the Undisputed Era look incredible. Um, the belts look great, so I think this year I'm keeping NXT as my developmental. And getting rid of one of my shows that I made this year. And just keeping NXT. So, the other ones will still be back, but, um, still only going to have five shows, so I'm going to eliminate one of them. But, Queen of the Rings, so we're going to start. We got, uh... Hey, what's up, Kush? How you been, man? Let's start with Kira Hogan, who I think is just gorgeous. And BB. Let's see what they put him in. Oh, BB's in her nice outfit. Uh -huh. So, standard, uh... Rules apply for Queen and King of the Ring. Two out of three falls match. See who gets through. Ah, oh, they put her in her black outfit. Which is fine anyway. I like to wear her titties. I mean, well, yeah, her titties. But her booty looks in them black pants. <sighs> you been good, Kush? I really should have lowered this. It's pretty loud in my ear. And here we go. Here comes one of the most popular women in my my UPW, BB. Big time singles matches coming so up. Here. All these women are vying for a chance to face Beverly, the Queen of the Ring. So the Phantom is waiting in the wings. So she is the current Queen of the Ring. That's not the kind of competitor she is. And she is waiting for the competitor who will make it through. We'll see which We'll see which Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time Lucky Which lucky Either Woman or victim Will be uh, one of the ones waiting for her in the wings Competitors in the division. No, oh, they're right there. And see how they're going to do against her. I think we're going to look back at these women and realize just how lucky we were to watch them compete. I guess. <laughs> I'm going to have to adjust the audio because this thing has been acting up stupid. So give me a second. All 
All right. Based on the electricity that BB and Kira arena, going at it. Hey, what's up, Wes? How you doing? To say the roof of this building just might blow off. When I looked at the card for tonight, this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss. Back in the ring again. Let's quickly discuss B for a moment. How about it? How is she going to win this tough matchup? When it comes to one-on-one -on -one action, she's among the absolute best the roster has to offer. Damn. I don't think there are too many women in the back itching to get in the ring with her. One thing I can say about her is if she does get beat, it won't be because of a lack of preparation or effort. Oh, thanks for that. Um, host, uh, Winey Lockett. Reveling the opportunity to make a mockery of her opponent. I appreciate that. What a spectacular move. Oh, Kira Hogan with the reversal on BB. She just slapped the taste out she of just slapped the shit out of her. Ooh. Pure artistry by her on that Hurricane Rana. Jawbreaker and Hurricane Rana. Which I saw. Um. Shit. What's that? Big dude's name in uh, NXT. I forget his name. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. I know it starts with a T. Um, really big dude. He's the guy that has the pounce. I can't remember his name right now for some reason. He did that shit on NXT this week. Ahun Kanrana. Be looking a little stunned here, but she knew this match wasn't going to be easy. Message delivered. She's wasting no time taking over this contest. So, so, saw some of the screenshots. The Velveteen Dream looks amazing. So does his, um, they show screenshots of his entrance. They look amazing. Um, oh, she's calling her for the BKO. She missed, but she oh she reversal. Akira. Uh, oh, reversal by BB, and she punched the living shit out of her. And what a headbutt by BB. BB can give some head. I can tell you that right now. She can suck a golf ball through a garden hose. And now she's on the offensive. <laughs> she's going for the cover. Kira with the uh, cover. Kicks out of that one. She's more durable than she looks, guys. And she hits the drop kick. I see where she's going. With oh. This. Kira Hogan. Oh. Jawbreaker reversal by BB. BB so with the Regal Cutter. Or the BB cutter, whichever way you want to go with that. Oh, and Kira Hogan kicks out just in time. And BB's walking around senselessly, not knowing what the hell to do. And drops a knee from the uh, middle rope, and now she's on the top rope. Oh, and there it goes again. A backwards flip onto the uh, abdomen of Kira Hogan. Sorry, just spraying my nose with uh, allergy medication, in case you hear that. And now she's working on Kira Hogan's uh, leg. Oh, Kira Hogan with the reversal. Now Kira's going up to the top. And she comes down and thinks twice. And BB was starting to get to her feet. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hit of weakness in the other. 
A neck wrench on BB. Slams her to the her back of the head to the to the mat. Oh, and here comes her signature. Oh, super kick. BB gets right up. Like if the super kick didn't do anything to her. Goes to the corner. Kira Hogan with the reversal. And now she's the one working on the leg. And Kira Hogan's calling for it. For her finisher. Neck breaker with a pin. And BB kicks out at the last second. This is going to be big, one way or another. No matter what goes on, it always seems like the women put on some of the best shows, whether it is on, um, you know, Raw, SmackDown, NXT in real life, pay-per-views, and on uh, WWE also. 2K18, and I'm sure they'll do the same. Saw some screenshots of the Riot Squad. Sarah Logan looks amazing. So does uh. Um, Ruby Riot, Sarah Logan, and um, two. Oh, and Kira Hogan kicks out at the last minute. Now why is her name escaping me right now? Liv Morgan also looks incredible. BB's calling for it again. Is she going to get it this time? She missed. And reversal again. BB's got to start learning uh, how to jump at the right time. BB might be in trouble here. For a oh, and she gets her. Goes for the pin. One, two. Oh, and BB kicks out. I would be here he gives her a little slap to the ass. BB with an uppercut. Oh, Kira Hogan. Reversal. Hey, what's up, Guardian? How are you today? BB reversed. Kira Hogan stands on the outside of the apron. She's inside with a super kick. Oh, and Kira Hogan's turned into some dirty tactics there. Um, Guardian, I don't have any room at all. I am, I have all 100 spots filled. That's what I'm hoping they do in 2K19 is give us a few more, like at least 150. BKO! Uh, hopefully they give us 150, maybe 200 spots. I highly doubt it. But it would be nice. I would like to get more people's uh, creative wrestlers in, in my shows. Ah, BB is calling for it again. BKO! Oh, that was a stunner earlier. That's the BKO. And Kira Hogan, she does not kick out. BB has the first out of three falls. BB with the comeback. And now Holland is being pushed to the break now. This may very well have a plan and executed it. Oh, oh clothesline kicks up. Uh, going to the top. BB's on the top. Is she going for her signature? Reversal. Oh. That has got to be it. There's almost no defense. Double feet to the like chest that. and abdomen. Kira Hogan on the reversal. <laughs> Super kick to BB. 
and BB kicks out. Showing some quickness there. And now she's on the offensive. Kira Hogan with a DDT. BB with a hurt Karana. I always feel like I'm saying that wrong. BB misses again. And she doesn't miss the second time. There's the BKO. Goes for the pin. Oh, Kira Hogan with the resiliency there to kick out before this is over. BB drops a really hard elbow on her. Reversal by Kira Hogan. And another kick. And Kira Hogan's playing to the crowd. Kira Hogan will be reversal. Oh, uh, they're going reversal for reversal for reversal. <laughs> oh, neck breaker by BB. Punches her. What is she going for? Oh, a tiger. Tiger slam. She should have went for the pin. Or a full Nelson uh, slam, whichever way you want to say it. Counters that one. <laughs> we have seen her here before. Oh, Kira Hogan. It's going for the neck breaker pin. <laughs> oh, BB. What about her resiliency? Kicking out again. And, she comes up with and a pin. reversal. To Kira Hogan. Oh, the backbreaker. Okay, now she's just showing off. Picks up Kira, throws her into the corner. What is she thinking about here? Oh. Shoulder, backflip, shoulder again. And she lands a perfectly executed <laughs> And kick. double. Kick from the ropes to her. Oh! The BB cutter. Kira Hogan might be the one in trouble now. BB is calling for it. Everybody knows it's the BKO! Pulls Kira Hogan. There's the one. Two. And BB makes it to the second round of the Queen of the Ring tournament. What a hard-fought hard victory for BB. These two women gave it their all. <laughs> but in the win, in the end, I'm sorry, BB comes out with a win. victory right there. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. I'm hoping they have the female referee in 2K19. I'd like to see Jess in there. Her name is Jessica. We do speak on Twitter. So, hoping to uh, see her on 2K19. Ask her how she feels about being a video game. All right, let's move on to the next match. It's Sophia. Sophia, one of the other popular women here. Against Taylor, another popular woman here. In another two out of three falls match. Let's get it going on. 
So don't remember who made Taylor Hendricks, but we'll see it. Uh, we'll see who made her as she comes out. Sophia was made by uh, Yams, who's a regular here. Sophia has arguably the best, the best entrance of any of the women here. <coughs> she also has happens to be, I believe. The Hardcore Women's Champion, I guess we will see when she comes out. Because if she is, she will come out with that belt. <laughs> and Taylor always beautiful as always. I'm a sucker for redheads, so... I'm enjoying this match because Sophia's a little bit of a redhead, just a little darker or lighter. I, mean, I don't know. But fuck it. <laughs> so why don't we just get this match started, huh? You're watching UPW on the TMK Network. Undisputed Pro Wrestling on the Maximus Kane Network, which will be returning in 2K19. Uh, TMK Network also, uh, I will be streaming uh, Madden 19. I will also be streaming uh, Call of Duty when that comes out. And she is the hardcore champion. I will also be streaming, um, as I said, uh, the new Call of Duty uh, Black Ops 4. It is actually good. It's not a disappointment as the last few have been. I uh, thank God to Treyarch. Because I was getting really tired that a whole... I mean, last year was shit. The year before that was shit. I mean... Like only one fucking space travel. The fuck. Victory. And the multiplayer sucked. And Corey, we should point out just how focused she appears to be here tonight. Now some of the uh, downfalls that people are saying no to the, she's the, ring with, she's always laser the new Call of Duty is that uh, instead of a hundred as damage as 150, so it takes a little bit of uh takes a little more to kill someone, but it just makes the game more competitive, I believe more difficult. Don't want a game that's going to allow you to uh, beat it so easily. Mr. Black Sheep, 008. Hopefully he brings her back in 2K19. If not, I will do my best to make her myself with her own face and everything. I will try. Some of these women I definitely want to keep. Are saying that these women are the top competitors in the division. Would you agree with that assessment? Well, the women's division certainly is stacked right now, Michael. But yeah, these competitors definitely stand out. The only thing I wouldn't know what to do with her is give her a big booty and her height and her weight. I don't know how I would make her outfit, but I know how I would make her face and then uh, her hair and everything like that. I would just have to. Uh, and there's the bell. And here we go. Ooh, jawbreaker by uh, Taylor right on Sophia at the beginning. I just have to be a little um, innovative. Oh, tosses her head backwards into the mat. Reversal by Sophia. What has to be going through the mind of Sparks right now? How's she going to get it done here? Sophia. They pay me to be part of the elbow to the back of that neck. Pinch me. And like grabs that. her, throws her down. Oh, kick to the, uh, to the titty. No, to the elbow. Uh, abdomen. Stomach. Quick pen attempt here. That's not going to do it. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. And she hits the drop kick. 
refresh my own page here because the sound is not going at the same time. Oh, and Sophia rolls out after that kick from uh, Taylor. Oh, Sophia's got her by the hair. Puts her on the ropes. Slingshots her back. Shit, the sound is still not sinking in with the video, but not on Kendrick's side. DDT to Kendrick's or Hendrick's by Sophia. Exactly what you're thinking, and I can tell you with all certainty, she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. These women are so evenly matched. Tossers is over the ring. Taylor with the reversal. Russian leg sweep on Sophia. She counters with a move. Sophia counters. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Flies around, twisting. Throwing her down. Oh! Spine buster. She's countering nicely now. Yes. Reversal by Taylor. Taylor! Face plant. Should have went for the pin. Now she goes for another jawbreaker, the same move she started with. Goes for a pin. And she barely got that one. Oh, kicking Sophia in the back. Oh, Taylor was in control. Taylor with a reverse DDT. Still in control at the moment. And tosses Sophia right outside. Remember, there are no countouts. There are disqualifications, but no time, no, no, no countouts. Don't like countouts. So, uh, believe it or not, there may not be any countouts in 2K19 for me. I don't want that shit happening. I do not like watching any match and in a timeout. I mean, in a in a countout. Taylor back in control after a short burst by Sophia. Suplex goes for the one. Sophia slowly getting up. Taylor was resting in the corner. Punch to the face. Reversal and punch back to Sophia. Oh, and here it comes. It's a power bomb. Into the Boston Crab. By Taylor. That will. That match will. That match. That move will be outlawed in 2019. 2K19. I will not let that move uh, be in the game. So just letting people know in advance if uh, you do have, if they still have that, you put on your character. Yes, you can still have your character in the universe, but that move, uh, you will have to either remove it or I will remove it on my own. Just making everybody know. Superstar can just land the finisher here. This match is all but over. Sophia wipes the sweat from her brow, goes to the second rope, winding up her arm. A few inches oh, went for the elbow and missed. missed oh, snapmare. Oh. If 
Sophia goes for the pin. She kicked out there, but she kicked out at one. Pardon me, forgive me for clearing my throat. Allergies. Oh, here she goes. She's using Taylor's own. She just slapped her with her own move. Her own move against her in the. Uh, Will this be it? The jumping tombstone. And Sparks has the first fall of the match. Sparks in a very bad way right now. This might just be the end of the road for her here, guys. She's obviously not looking great right now, guys. But if she can somehow execute her finisher again, she'll be walking away from this match with her arm raised in victory. Mark my words. And she's trying to flip the script here. Easier said than done, Michael. Counters that one. Oh, what is Sophia doing here? Going up to the top rope. Elbow this time. Fuck you, Michael Cole. They're not called divas anymore. They're women wrestlers. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's got to hurt. Her neck must be dying right now. After that move. so far. This match has been even more physical than I thought it would be. Avoids trouble there. Okay, now she's just showing off. So it was down with Kimia. Taylor goes for a pin. Barely gets it too. This could be it. Oh, she's got her. I don't know, guys. I really thought Is she going to tap? No, she's not. Amazingly, she gets her way free. Cole, there may be no beating her here tonight. And she slams her back down. She's licking her chops. Oh, Sophia goes for a kick and misses. Goes for the punch. Oh, backstabber. This could do it. Goes for the pin. Oh, and Taylor just escapes that. Just in time. I think we're at the point of this match where the finisher could be used at any moment. Taylor with the reversal. Trying to make her comeback. Oh, now she's going for the jumping tube stone. And there she goes. She might be too close to the ropes for a pin. Unless she decides to put her over. Which it seems like she's doing. Taking the advice. <laughs> oh, and Sophia kicks out at the last second. Sophia with some revenge with that spine buster. Oh. She should have bridged that with a pin. Kick to the leg. She goes for a pin on uh, Taylor. Taylor kicks out. <laughs> Dodges that one. She's got that gleam in her eyes. Oh, and Taylor's calling for it. Oh, jumping. Power driver. Not really jumping, but kind of like a hop more than anything. Will this be it? 
Oh, and she kicks out at the very last second again. And Sophia makes it through. And that's where Taylor got her first. Uh, making her tap. But in the end, it was a pedigree that put Taylor down and gives Sophia the win. So it looks like it's going to be uh, two of the most beautiful women in, in uh, UPW. Uh, Sophia and Bibi going at it in the second round. <laughs> I believe we have a couple of women from the uh, same creator. Yes, we do. We have Viper and Toxin, both created by Metallic Deadpool. They're going at it. Viper is no stranger to, to the Phantom, Beverly, White. They are mortal enemies here in uh, UPW on uh, All-Star Women's Wrestling. So they're going to go at it. Uh, again, both created by the same uh, character. I mean, uh, character. Same person. Um, it's Alec Deadpool. He is a uh, gentleman in Ireland. Very nice guy. Of course, here, I don't know. I know they don't have the, uh, the long weekend there like we have here. Because tomorrow is Labor Day here in the U.S. So, we're going to see which one of these women of his creation can uh, get through to the next round. I know Viper's looking to take that title. She's been on a roll lately. She's won uh, seven matches in a row against uh, Beverly, the Phantom herself, inside the universe. <laughs> This is outside the universe. She's hoping to keep her winning streak going so she can uh, catch up. I mean, Beverly has over 20 wins on her. So Viper is trying to catch up. Toxin is uh, got a pretty good winage, winning percentage. Above 80. And both women are intimidating. Big time singles matches on deck here and Byron. What should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. Both women are definitely definitely absolutely but that should intimidating especially considering how intense the women's to say the least. Damn. Is it me or does this game sound like it's louder than I am? 
Might have to lower this. <laughs> Not working in the regular uh, audio settings, so I might have to go into the broadcast settings inside um, Xbox itself and change it. Although, I don't think I've changed it, uh, so I don't know why this game has gotten louder. It sounds like I've gotten. Oh, Panther. Why I'm uh, sounding lower than the game. But of course, it could be me. I mean, I can hear the music in my headset. Uh, you guys can't hear the music. So. A lot of these people came to see tonight, and with good reason, Michael. This one's been brewing for quite some time. You can hear everything else. And Byron, what should we be but out for here tonight? Well, needless to say, these women are eager. Since I am the one with the mic, inside the women's locker room, you guys can uh, see them use every trick in the book to secure a victory here tonight. I hear the game pretty loud. And although you guys can't hear the music, it still seems that the game is a little too loud. It is too loud in my ears, so right before this match starts, I'm going to have to uh, just jump over real quick and uh, change the audio. Because this shit is loud as fuck in my ear. If anybody watches this back later, I can understand. I can definitely understand if you aren't uh, watching it live just because I haven't been broadcasting lately. Had a lot of things going on. But at the same time, I have not been broadcasting. Let me just pause this for a moment so I can change the uh, volume on this game. So, just give me a moment here. Just give me one second. Okay, now, if it is seems louder than I, I don't know what else to do. I've taken every precaution I could to make it uh, quieter, at least in my ear. And hopefully now, I am uh, louder than the game. Viper is a heavyweight. And she's going up to the top rope. And, oh, cross body down on Toxin. That's got to hurt. Oh, she was going for what looked like a power bomb and Toxin with the reversal. Snapmare. Reversal by Viper. And another reversal by Toxin. Viper, oh, a reverse suplex to the face. Oh, she's got her in a submission hold. Can't remember the name of it, but it's Toxin. No, Toxin reverses it. I gotta get myself more familiar with these fucking moves. I know what they are, but just forget about. I forget what they are at the last moment. Toxin turns the tables for just a moment. Uh, 
Oh, Toxin was in control for just a second. Viper takes control over the match again. Oh, Viper's calling for it. She is calling for a choke slam. Nice choke slam by Viper. Goes for the pin. Hey, what's up, Silver? How you doing? And Viper gets the first uh, first fall and tosses Toxin right in the corner. I'm doing good. Okay, so far, uh, never seen a bruised hip. Hopefully, it's just bruised that I don't have to get it replaced at my, you know, young age. But. <coughs> Toxin with an STO. What's Toxin up to? Oh, backwards elbow off the second rope. And now she's got her. In the iron bar. No submission. Viper misses with that kick. Uh -oh. I'm afraid to think what's gonna happen next. She tosses her up. Oh, what a reversal by Viper. Back off the second rope. With a knee to the back of Viper's head. And a big boot. Oh, power bomb! She should have went to uh, for a pin there. It was a pinning combination. She didn't do it, but she is calling for the choke slam once again. Oh, and what a reversal by Toxin! Oh, Toxin! Spitting that green mist in her face. Didn't work. You're an Aggie on Toxin. Spinning side slam. She didn't go for the pin. Oh, there she is. Oh, and Toxin kicks out just in time. Viper arguing with the referee. Viper calling for the choke slam again. I don't know if Viper's going to be uh, successful this time. And she is. No reversal by Toxin this time. And there is your winner going on to the next round. A Viper. One step closer to her nemesis the phantom herself Beverly to try and get that queen of the ring belt platinum belt and the title queen of the ring at least for this week Good action going on between both of these women. All three matches so far have been pretty good. We're going into the first hour of the tournament. Three good matches. So we have Sophia Sparks going against BB. And Viper just winning now against, uh, I mean, yeah. Viper just winning now against Toxin. And now we're going to see who... Uh, Viper's a uh, opponent's going to be in the next match. Um, in the when I do the pay per views and stuff like that, what I do is I I do let the computer play, but your character can be rated up to a hundred, 
everybody's character can be rated up to 100. So, try to make it as even as possible. <laughs> Because even if you do it, like, say you go down to an 84, people try to make it as, uh, what's the word, as even or as um, fair as possible, dropping that down, down to 84. But if everybody's at 100, it's still even. It just brings out the full potential of every wrestler on the show. So, man or woman brings out their full potential. So, I think it works better that way. You get more action. The matches last a lot longer. Um, when they're lower, um, they seem to end too quickly. And you want the matches to continue and give you some good action. You don't want them to just die out out of nowhere. So... Silver, do you have a uh, a guy or or, or a female C A W? <laughs> and there is a huntress, Hanya. Also made my Mr. Black Sheep. Making her way to the ring from Brooklyn, New York, Hannah. One on one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet it'll be memorable. She clearly looks to be in great shape, but Corey, is she mentally prepared for this match here tonight? Well, she better be, because if she's not, I can guarantee that tonight is going to be a very short... The Huntress herself, Hanya. And her Waiting for Mandy Leon from uh, Ring of Honor Wrestling, but also from AWW here, All-Star Women's Wrestling. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. Well, guys, she certainly has her work cut out for her here tonight. That's for sure. Yeah, but she knew that coming in, Cole. I assure you, she did her homework and knows exactly what to expect from her opposition here. These ladies are ready to tie up and see what happens. If you get a chance, go on and check out my YouTube page. It's the Maximus Kane. YouTube Gaming. There's the link right there. Or just look me up on YouTube, the Maximus Kane. If you got, if you forget to put the word "the" in the front of it. You might still find me, but the first thing you're going to see is uh, my profession and um, a link to my uh, website. First, before you get right to YouTube. What I do... Uh, broadcast here I do download uh, the broadcast and I do uh, upload some of them right to YouTube <laughs> you can definitely watch them on VOD here on mixer but get a little bit more uh, better quality on YouTube if you watch it there so Oh, small package.
Oh, she's going for a nice little swing there. Tanya's down. And she is playing to the crowd, Mandy is. Uh, do you have a male or a female wrestler? She's looking at it. And she's it early. A male? Yeah, heavyweight, light heavyweight, uh, cruiserweight, what is I have no fucking idea what Mandy's doing right now. She's in a bad way here. Bottom line, she's got to get up. She can't win this match on her back. That one misses big time. Better luck next time. Here, a guardian. If you have um, the hashtag for your character, you between heavyweight and light heavyweight. Okay, you have the hashtag for your character. Put it right there in the. Um, in the uh, chat window, I'll take a screenshot and I'll look him up. I'll do the same thing for Silver when he comes in. I'll open up a couple of spots. You forgot? Well, what's the? Uh, is it under your name, or do you remember what the guy, uh, what your character's name is? Acid. Do you want to go and uh, check it out first? See what he, what his. Uh, oh, what a power bomb by Hanya! Okay, and then come back in here and just put it in the chat window. Oh, Hanya, what is she up to here? Oh. What is Mandy calling for? She shows signs of life. She oh, reversal life. by the Huntress herself. She's licking her chops. I think she should stay down. Oh, what an acrobatic move from there. Mira quién quién está aquí. ¿Cómo está pasando la cosa? Nothing much. And this has got to be it. One, two, two and a half. So close to a fifth. Oh, two and a half. Man, I haven't used a cam in a while. I don't know why. Just haven't. Just haven't. I haven't been really. <laughs> Thanks. I haven't really been interested. I'm waiting for. um. <laughs> 2K19 to come out. I'll definitely be on camera for that. Um, probably be on camera for Call of Duty when it comes out so people can see my frustration when I fucking get killed or don't kill anybody. Yeah, man. I'm after the last few CODs that have sucked. Um... I'm really excited about this one. Because the last ones have been horrible. But Treyarch knows how to make a damn good game. A hell of a lot better than uh, the others. I think I have our beta uh, match. Oh, small package. I think I have our beta match up on our in my YouTube page. Oh, and Mandy with the first fall. Oh, 
Comes up big with the reversal. Okay. Now that one well scouted. She's got her in her sights. Oh, inverted or reverse DDT. What pick last night? What did I miss? Oh, in Discord? No, because my Discord doesn't go off. I It was going off too much. So I had stopped it uh, from going off, but let me check it out now. No, I didn't. She needs to find a way to get to her feet. Oh shit, that happened already. Too, Fuck. One more shot and she's done. Shit. Any uh surprises? I don't give a shit. You can you can uh you know do some uh spoilers here. Any surprises of who showed up or Who showed up? Where were we? Okay, Guardian, take a look. What Undertaker pick is in is what he's going to look like in 2K19. Okay. Oh, he's gonna look like the badass? Oh, okay. Okay, hold on. Let me look somewhere else. At this point, it looks like even the winner of this match will walk out of here beaten back. Oh, man, she's rolling now. Oh, big evil. Okay. Okay. There it is. Oh, nice. Very nice. The good old days. I miss those. Di I miss those days. Guardian, let me check out your uh, message right now. Hold on. Okay, I should be able to find him. Look at him go. Shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> and Savage, if you're in here, if you uh, have the, I mean Silver, if you're in here, and you have um. Hey, what's up, G Money? This could be the one that ends her. Look at this. I'll be shocked if that's not it. Oh, what a shot by Hanya. Final nail in the coffin. Um, I got a bruised hip. Hopefully, it, that's all it is. It's just a bruised hip. She's got that gleam in Because if not, I'm going to have to get it replaced at this young age of mine. That's not something I'm going to do right now. Inverted DDT. How are you doing? Oh, and Hanya. Evening it up here. I'm impatiently waiting for Cod. Oh, no. Tell you the truth. 
more worried about that than uh all right not a problem what an amazing move. if anybody gets a chance go to g money's uh mixer page it's fun to sit in there and watch uh give her some feedback give her some views some follows donate do whatever you can Fun being in there. Oh, Mandy with an elbow. And she's always smiling non stop. So if you're in here or if you uh, come back and watch this later, you can always uh, go to G Money's. She's got to find a way to get up here, guys. That won't be easy, Michael, given the beating she's taken so far. She's looking at Page and watch. Now she just needs to finish her off. No, there's the reversal. And not to be outdone. You can usually see her on there with here we go again, yo. Oh, Mandy takes the win. Uh, you can see him on there. Um, they usually hang out together. Uh, so, funny. Great to see them on there. Definitely check out their channels. Give them some views. Give them some follows. Fuck, raid them, man. Give them a nice little raid. Raid me. That's uh, a couple uh, different letters which make that sound really weird. You know, nothing made me happier than when I lock in Lucky 13 and make my opponents tap out. If you also get a chance, go and check out Wesley Wolf's uh, page. He also does wrestling and... Uh, He's on uh, PC, so the graphics look a lot better than they do now. All right, we got BB and Sophia. So BB is one of my creations, and then the Queen of the Ring herself is my creation. So that is BB Rexa. That has her face on it against uh, Yam Sophia Sparks. G Money, what have you been playing lately? To G pop or B pop or yeah, uh, um, pop G. I'm sorry. Days and scum. I don't know what days and scum is. New games. Oh. I was gonna say you're calling me scum. I was like, gee, what the fuck? The acid shall rain. Okay. The beta for Battlefield comes out this week. Is it an open beta or is it if you pre-ordered it?
I didn't pre-order it. We have one-on-one -on -one action on the way, and this one should be nothing short of amazing. I don't doubt that for a moment, Michael. In fact, I would go so far as to say this match might just steal the show. And I'd say these women definitely look ready to get... I like the premise of having... <coughs> excuse me. Of having, you know, a ton of people playing. But I never do well on it. On Battlefield. And I didn't do well on uh, Star Wars Battlefront. Made by EA as well. Same premise. Uh, too many fucking people all, all over the place. Can never do anything. I know there's... You know, it's a little obviously it's different than uh, Call of Duty, but what's up, Glitch? From Manhattan, New York, the undisputed Check out Glitchy's channel too. You can click right on his name. There goes Sophia Sparks, the hardcore champion. <laughs> Glitchy comes in just in time to watch BB, one of his favorites. So you can definitely check out all those people's pages. I will tell you right now, out of all those people's pages that I did tell you to go and check out, um, uh, G Money is the prettiest out of all of them because the others. Are not. Uh, none. None of them. Especially Glitchy. Glitchy's just not. A, he's ugly as fuck. No, I'm just fucking with you, Glitch. They all have their. <laughs> they all have their, their, their own little advantages and little. Of things to watch and make. Uh, their channels unique and fun. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without YouTube bozos interrupting me. In addition to that, Byron, I'm a dime. He's a dime. You, you hear it from, from the man himself. So go and check it out. G Money's got a uh, green screen behind her. So uh, one of these days when I uh, go and see. Uh, one of these days when I go and see your channel, I want to see a Godzilla come in to try and eat you. Who the fuck is this asshole? Oh, thanks for the uh, follow, agent. Like, put a Godzilla or a monster behind you. We'll figure it out. <laughs> Hey, welcome back, Agent. <laughs> and Sophia's beating the shit out of BB. She is the hardcore champion. There is no count outs. It was a joke. Here we go again. Did you find um, the hard drive you were looking for? Last time I saw you. She's got her. She is on fire. Now that one well scouted. She got her with a reversal. And she turns it around. No, not yet. Oh, that's gotta suck. What's up, Mace? How's it been? Oh. 
Oh, the BB cutter. Great, I'm glad that you're doing well. Me, um, been dealing with a bruised hip. Um, my brother has cancer, but they found it in stage one, so it's treatable. Oh, pedigree. He starts, uh, starts treatment on Friday. And as long as he does what the doctors say, he should be free and clear in a year. So, he's 52. And, I mean, that's not old anymore. When I was growing up, 52 was old as fuck, but not anymore. Thank you, I appreciate it. And my kids uh, all, well, two of my kids started uh, college last week. The third one starts this week. They all go back on Tuesday. But they have tomorrow off since it's Labor Day, so I'm stuck with them for three days. Fuck me. Oh. Reverse. Flip. Oh, she's calling for the B. What is she calling for, Glitch? Oh. The BKO. Oh, and Sophia kicks out. She is showing that she is hardcore for real. Oh my God, BB's got another one in her back pocket, looking for another BKO. Oh my God, out of nowhere. There's another pin. Oh, and BB gets the first out of the three falls. Oh, spine buster. Little revenge there on BB. <laughs> oh, she's going for another pedigree. Oh, and now they are 1-1, one, one, so now they are in sudden death. Next pin wins the match. Oh, the BB cutter. And is she going for it? No! Oh! Damn. And there it is, out of nowhere. Shades of Randy Orton. And BB advances to the semifinals. Actually, to the finals of the tournament. And then uh, if she wins, she gets to face... Um, the Phantom, Beverly White herself. Oh, we still got another match left. To find out who will be facing BB in the next round. Hello, Firebrand. How are you? Here is your winner, B -B. And BB makes it through. We can all agree that was an extremely impressive win. Let's move on to find out who BB's opponent's going to be. These women have been putting on some damn good matches.
Okay, so who will face BB in the finals to go against the Phantom? Will it be Viper? Or will it be Mandy Leon? Remember, Viper is a heavyweight, and so is the Queen of the Ring. But Mandy is uh, difficult to beat. Hey, we got two for Mandy. <coughs> oh, thanks for the host glitch. So Viper was made by Metallic Deadpool and Yams made uh, Mandy Leon. Mandy Leon is uh, pretty accurate. Viper is really, 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 really tall. You don't care about women's wrestling? Why? They're putting on better matches than the guys. Hey, he remembered that. Glitchy. No, um, a friend of mine, Yams, made her. <laughs> and here she comes. WWE's top star is ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. Well, to say she looks ready to go here might just be an understatement. Yeah, Cole, she's been looking forward to this one for a very long time. It sounds like this crowd has been, too. She is intimidating. Hey, that guy's got the best seats in the house. That woman is jacked, and she is very, very intimidating. And no, I would not sleep with her if she was real. For years I've been locked away in an asylum, sad, defeated. But tonight I have escaped. Tonight the access shall rain. Okay. I would one time though. <laughs> Byron, I think these women may be caught off guard a bit by the stellar crowd reaction they're receiving here. I don't know why, Michael. It seems like they get one of the biggest reactions each and every week. You think they'd be used to it by now? Is and there they go. Oh, Mandy takes control right off the bat. I just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. When you have competitors on the level of these women, you just know it's going to be a great match. Mandy's still in control over the heavyweight Viper. There's plenty to talk about when dealing with Piper. What kind of attack is she going to mount here? She's certainly a force cold, but you have to remember who she's in the ring with there, too. Hey, what's up, zombie? Pushovers, that's for sure. And I could not agree more. As a superstar in the WWE today, there are plenty of opportunities. We'll just have to see if she can take advantage of them. Join her 
strength off of that power bomb. <laughs> yep, I do too. And now I have to go back and watch all in because I missed it. Shit. From NJPW and ROH. A quick finish. Can she do it? You're not going to get her that easy. Try for it early. Oh, Viper's in control now. Oh, deadlift. Slam. <laughs> Just do it. Just like Nike says. Just do it. Sure. And she's knocked off her feet. I think that one caught her by surprise, Michael. Oh, and a beautiful leap. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Oh, man, he's taking her for a spin. A big move coming up, but is it enough to end it? She's countering nicely now. Oh, man, he went for a kick. She was almost done. She's able to get out of the way there. Bad news here for Leon. To be expected, though, given the competition she's in there with. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it. Press it. Looking for the win. Yeah, 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 yes. There it is. Coming in. Oh. Choke slam. Wow, that was close, so close. That would have been a shocker. Another deadlift here. Slam. And another. Thank you. She appears to be in complete control of this one. Damn, she is beating her head into that corner. Viper goes for the pin. Mandy kicks out at one. She's having a hard time Showing some resiliency, Mandy. He's just saying some really disturbing shit. Creeping the fuck out, man. She's got Mandy. Oh. That sucks. She's too close. That's going to be a rope break. There may not be count outs, but there are rope breaks. There are disqualifications. No count outs because they do not like count outs. Leon is getting trounced here. She may very well have reached the point of no return. If she even has any idea where she is right now, she's probably wondering why all those finishers failed. Oh, kick to the back. Mandy. Viper is tired. Going for another choke slam, is she? 
And she gets it. Drags what is, uh, looks like her dead carcass. And she kicks out again. I gotta be impressed with that. That's, that's some shit. Oh, and Viper gets the first ball, I believe. Great women's action here in WWE. Look at this. She's trying to turn the tables right here. Get out of the way. She ain't playing. I think she's trying to prove a point here. And now she's on the offensive. But Mandy's not done yet. She's still got some fight back in her. Oh, look out. She hits her with a wicked elbow. Nope, reverses it. Oh, she is choking her. Mandy is done. Mandy's got it. She is done. So Mandy will face BB to see who will face the queen of the ring herself, the phantom Beverly White. There's your winner, ladies and gentlemen. Michael, your pride definitely takes a hit when you're forced to tap out. Wow. And Viper is proud of herself. What an amazing match. And here we go. It is the lovely BB versus Viper. Um, Viper gets through. She has the potential to become the queen of the ring. She's been on a roll winning against uh, Beverly, the Phantom. But um, my case, I am uh, rooting for BB. Sorry, I just I, I I'm rooting for BB. She is my creation, and I'm just rooting for. Her. Everybody loves BB. BB a babe. Yes, she is. In real life, too. Okay, here comes BB. Making her way to the ring from Brooklyn, New York. BB. Good 
with WWE's top stars ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. Corey, I would say that these women look more than ready to get this match underway. So am I, Cole. In fact, I've been looking forward to this one ever since it got announced. And here we go. Um, no, did you send me something? Because my shit was going off all the time, so I turned off the um, the you know the um. And I would say this match will have a big impact notifications. on the competitors moving forward. With but I'm going to look now. And given how heated the women's division is right now, even a single loss can set you back considerably. I am looking now. Un momento, one moment, please. Did you put it in, in mine? Under... What, hold on. Oh, shit. What's this guy's name? Grime? Nah, you are a sick motherfucker, you know that? We're all along for the ride on this one. But make no mistake about it, we're going to have a winner. And with the women's division as white hot as it is right now, you just know this match is going to be one for the. I just saw the movie The Rings, just rings, in general, and uh, every fucking person you make looks like the bitch that comes out of the TV. More than anything else, man or woman. Hey guys, I want to discuss B for a moment. What kind of attack is she going to mount here? This crowd is absolutely electric. Face off, fucked up and shit. This is going to be a great one. Yeah, all I know is she can definitely make a name. Not that it's not fun. It's fun. Well. Look at her here. She's just reveling the opportunity to make a mockery of her opponent. I have decided I will be keeping NXT next year, 2K19, because their belts look so good. Um... No, it'll be NXT. I'll leave it. <laughs> the belts look amazing. Um, the people like the Undisputed Era look incredible. Um, so I think this will be the first year where I keep NXT. And then uh, that'll be one of my five shows. Because I'm still keeping the women's show. All women's show. So, still keeping Global Alliance. Still keeping uh, AWA, um, but of course it all depends on what names they let us give it, you know, for the belts. Oh, BB, Hell's Gate. Hey, we all know how aggressive she and she breaks free. I don't know how she did it. That was impressive. B looking a little stunned here. But this certainly oh yeah. She can't come back. And she escapes the submission. Not a lot of people could break out of that one, Mike. I still have everything from this one. Faces, uh, logos, stuff like that. Damn, BB, shit. Look at her go. Oh, and it's a reversal. I don't know. She is on fire. Maybe Maximum and Apocalypse sound good together the 
Big boot to BB. That huge bitch is calling for this shit. Oh, reversal by BB. Oh, well then, yeah. I can't, I couldn't remember. Oh, what's she calling for? What is she calling for? Oh, she missed. Oh, what a spear to the giant. Is she go oh, she's calling for it. I thought she, oh, what is she calling for? Oh, shit. She may not have gotten the fall, but damn. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in BB leg drop, elbow, forearm. Oh, the BB cutter. Oh damn, she's gone up for it again. She's looking at it. No reversal this time by BB. No. Oh shit. Oh, kick out by BB. There's the comeback by the heavyweight right into the corner. Look at that. Oh, is it? Yeah, she's now. Shit, I might not get to my paper, my uh, WrestleMania by the time this shit is over. She should have went for the pin after all that. Oh, but the big boot. You're also having a women's pay-per-view? <laughs> About fucking time. She comes up big with a reversal. With a move like that. You have to make 35. Oh! The BB cutter. This should do it right there. Two dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. She's not done yet, but you have to believe that she's still an all Yeah, I've done the women's pay per view. It's, a lot. it's fun to have the women do the pay per view. They they go crazy. What is BB doing? Oh Hun Karana. And BB is now playing to the crowd. Twelve what women paper uh, pay per views? She wasn't even close, Michael. She counters with a move of her own. Look at her go. I think she's trying to prove the Oh, reversal after reversal. Oh shit. Oh, power bound slam. Yeah, I hear you. Oh, she punches BB in the face. BB with a reversal. Another Hurricane Rana. Funny how that. Oh. Bulldog, that punch to the face didn't do anything to her, but is she done? Oh! That was a mistake. Trying to show off her, uh... 
Oh. Oh, reversal into the corner. Oh, BB with the reversal. BB. Oh. Byron, can she even get back to her feet? What's BB going for now? Elbow to the chest of Viper. She's going for the oh, right to this to the abdomen. BB is tired now. Have there has there been a fall yet? I do not recall. BB pulls Viper up. BB cutter. Are the B a BKL? Sorry. Funny, they're in a rev in a rivalry on mine too. Oh, tilt a world slam, and now she's calling for another choke slam. Has there been a fall besides BB? Does Viper have a fall yet? Oh, and BB kicks out at the last second. And she's toying with her now. Oh, she's calling for another one. Momentum clearly in her corner. Another choke slam. BB might be out. Oh my god. Oh my god, another choke slam. She's calling for another one. This could end it in a hurry. B might be done for this time. Three in a row. There's no way she's kicking out of this one. Oh, and now they're even. I thought uh, Viper had one already. But no. Oh, what's, what's Viper going for? Oh, using that big, big ass to uh, choke the blonde beauty. Oh, what a flying shoulder. Oh, BB with the reversal. Oh, BB was looking for the comeback. What the fuck was that? Oh, BB kicks out immediately on that pin. BB with another reversal. BB spine buster pin. Spine Buster modified power bomb pin. Well, she's absorbed a lot of punishment so far tonight. BB's going up to the top again. Is she going for the backwards? Backwards flip right into the chest. And slams her down with authority. Should have went for the pin. Always say that. Oh, damn. Oh, big boo to BB. BB might be done for. Oh, thanks for the follow, Phantom. Appreciate it. BB with a reversal on Viper. Kicks her. Oh, reversal by Viper. Viper's going for the... Oh, BB is done. She is choking her out. And BB is done for. BB. BB looked like she was going to pull that one out. It was a good game. And now the two arch nemesis. Is nemesis. nemesis uh, go against each other. In Beverly White, the Phantom against Viper.
and see if Viper can take the uh, Queen of the Ring championship belt away from the Phantom herself. Here is your winner, Piper. Okay, we're going to go past her because she scares me. Yeah, I want a BB to win too. I don't have any open spaces, Phantom, but if you do you know um what you have uh what the um <coughs> hashtags are? I'll take a look. Wouldn't be a problem. It's the end of the uh 2K18, I can uh, replace him. All right. So here we go. Viper versus the Phantom. Beverly White for the Queen of the Ring Championship. That Platinum Championship. Both of these women are heavyweights. Metallic Deadpool made uh, Viper, I believe. And I made Beverly on the right side. With the face of Katie Lantz, who plays uh, the White Canary on the CW. <laughs> Something unique about both of these women. They're both tall. I think there's only a four pound difference between the two, with Beverly having just about four pounds more. Both, I believe, are 6'4. And, you know, with Beverly, she and Viper. They both ride uh, bikes. Yeah, I did. They both ride bikes, and I need a ride or die chick. But it ain't this one. Not this one. I know Velveteen Dream looks amazing too, but no, you know what? What the fuck really is? Braun Strowman went from 100 last year to 89. Corey, what must be going through the challenger's mind right now? Well, I hope she's not already thinking about how her side yeah. would look on the title. If she's already looking Did you see the Riot Squad? As good as done here Sarah Logan looks so good. So does. Oh my God. She looks so good. And so did um uh I said this earlier, I couldn't remember. Um What's the other one? Shit. Liv Morgan, I'm sorry, she looks good too. But Sarah Logan, she really looks good. Okay. Oh, thanks for the uh, follow, La Sabine. Who the fuck is this asshole? That was quick. You have returned. How are you today, Beam? Or should I say tonight? How are you tonight? Good, I'm glad to hear you're doing well. Ah, uh, dealing with a bruised tip. Hopefully that's all it is. Other than that, I'm in uh, good spirits, I guess. Now, like I said, I need a ride or die chick. This is a ride or die chick I need. Right here, coming out right now. The Phantom herself, Beverly White. Yeah, my daughter's wants me to so I might I might have to go and get x-rays and shit 
There is your queen of the ring. Again, as I said, I made Beverly from Katie Lance, who plays the White Canary. Yeah, I know. And I made her a beast. And I had to because Viper was a beast. All right, let me take a screenshot of that. Um, oh, the hair bright. Yeah, when I took the uh, the picture of Katie Lotz, she actually had her hair that color. <coughs> and she's a uh, strawberry blonde, but she really dyed it really, really, really bright pink. Or hot pink, maybe? Introducing the champion. From the wasteland, she is the undisputed pro wrestling prestigious women's champion. And that is what they're fighting for, folks. The Queen of the Ring Platinum Championship. There are no crowns here. There are no, th well, they're thrones, I guess, but... No, if you wrestle for this Queen of the Ring or King of the Ring, you get a belt. The men's King of the Ring belt is solid gold. Currently held by Lazara. And you can't see it, but both of these women are about 6'4". They are big. I gave, Be I gave Beverly a big ass. You will notice that any woman that I make, I give them a really big ass. Believe it or not, some people are actually saying this is the night where the champ gets picked off. Even in a black, you can see that she's got a big butt. <laughs> Damn, she tossed her into the corner like she was nothing. It's required in UPW. <laughs> Should be the challenger strategy in there. Oh, jawbreaker reversal by Viper. Yeah, thick man. I mean, she can have a really, you know, she don't have to be thick, but she got a big butt. Yeah, tits are just extra, but they work. I try and give them a, you know, big ones. Oh, right into the corner. Power slam. And she goes for the pin. She just threw her down. Oh, what is she going for? Inverted DDT. Wow, look at that ad athleticism. By the Phantom. Reversal by Viper. Now the Phantom has beaten Viper 23 times. But Viper has now beaten her, I believe, seven times in a row. After getting her ass kicked 23 times in a row. Sooner or later, like got to shine on a dog that someday. Oh, pulling on her hair. Don't pull on that hair. Oh, reversal. Oh, okay. Reversal by Beverly. Jericho, her man got to be happy right now. At the moment, while she's in control. Don't want to get too... Oh, what a punch to the face. Oh, shit. Oh, reversal. As she was going for the gut buster. Cobra Cut Slam, I believe. Could be wrong. Oh, she reverses that. Oh! Swinging Sidewalk Slam. Oh, 
Piper going for a choke slam. And she hits it. Oh, and the champ kicks out of two. Let's go, cause see. This character I made him. Where? I haven't seen him in a while. I mean, I haven't been streaming in a while, but where is? I haven't seen him. Vipers coming back here. Crossbody. Oh, and kicking Beverly in the face with them nasty ass legs. Oh, she grabs her leg. What is she going for? Oh, a body slam, choke slam. Corey, she's not getting up. Well, she better if she wants to win this match. <laughs> she's calling her out. Oh, is she she's calling for the gut buster. Is she gonna get it this time? Oh no, she's she's not swinging. Sidewalk slam again. Goes for the pin. Oh, and Viper kicks out. What a match! And why does Viper have those fucking abs like that? Viper with the reversal. Oh, another reversal by the Phantom. And just knocked her the fuck out. <laughs> another reversal by Viper. And where's this big bitch going? Oh, and the champ kicks out. Oh, the acolyte. <laughs> oh, she... Re Damn, she reversed that pretty quick. She got out of that fast. Oh, to the, the uh, kick to the face. Spoke too soon. Oh, choke slam. Oh, and she gets that choke slam. Beverly might be done here. Oh, kick out by the Phantom. Oh, what's Beverly? Oh, punch to the face. Beverly, very European uppercut. Viper stalking her prey. Beverly gets up again. Another punch to the face. Swing and sidewalk slam again. Oh, and Beverly with the first fall. <laughs> the queen is in control right now. Damn, she just threw her like she was nothing from the back. Oh, and now she is pissed. Has she got her comeback? She does have her comeback. Beverly is very agile. And she kicks up after that clothesline. Double, <laughs> double choke slam to Viper. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, Viper 
with a suplex. That should be oh rope break. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. There's the big boot. Look at big boot. Oh, reversal. She got her with a reversal. Well, what does the command mean? Not so fast. One more look at it. Oh, she's going for the gut buster. She's going for... Oh, gut buster. Goes no for the pin. Oh, kick out by Viper. Oh, okay. I'll do it after the match because I don't want to miss this. The match is good. I don't want to miss it. Oh, the athleticism again. From the Phantom. Reversal by the Viper. Viper's picking up Beverly. Going for a suplex. Oh, Beverly reverses it. A suplex of her own. Very European uppercut again. And the pin. And the queen retains her belt. Beverly White just beat the living shit out of the man beast woman. Viper. Now that is a uh, 24 and 7. 24 wins for the Phantom, 7 for. No, uh, yeah, uh, 20, 23 and. Um, 23. Damn. That's a lot. <laughs> 23 wins and only 7 for uh, Viper. That's an ass kicking right there. That's uh, you got knocked the fuck out. And she looks good in that. She looks good in pretty much anything she's in. And yes, ride or die chick. I'll be on the back of her bike or shit. I'll, I'll, I'll ride the bike and she can just sit in the back. Since this is an 18 plus over channel, then I don't give a fuck. Be a good way to uh, have her riding her bike and me finger blasting her while I'm sitting on the back as her passenger. A plastic bag. And Viper makes it to the end. Got to commemorate this with a screenshot. And there it is. Beverly White retains her belt. And she is all good. Alright, that is my show for today. I will be back tomorrow with this tournament here I will show you exactly what we'll be fighting for there's gonna be a couple tournaments tomorrow and a sh uh, and a pay-per-view <laughs> the tournaments will be another ass fest for this we have to have this one and the King of the Ring. King of the Ring belt needs to be defended. So does the UPW Men's Hardcore Championship. The JCW World Championship. The Interpromotional Men's and Women Championship. Also the UPW Hardcore Championship held by Wesley Wolf. Also needs to be defended. Um, the Hardcore Women's, I don't know. I don't know if I have enough women... Uh, teams, but I have enough women total. 
And uh, Sophia might have to uh, defend her hardcore championship also. A lot of tournaments, still a lot of time left before October and 2K19. Velveteen Dream right there, he will be in the next game. He looks amazing. I know he's only uh, Rudy, 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 Rudy. What are you talking about, Rudy? Rudy Giuliani? What? Oh, Ruby. Um, yeah, she's the uh, women's champion on Wrestling Zone. Actually, let's see what the next pay-per-view is, because I might be doing that tomorrow with a couple of tournaments. So, Labor Day, I might be. Who knows? I might stream for a long period of time tomorrow. Oh, Tyson Wade is in first place up here. Now, Tyson Wade and Joey are the four horsemen. They've been trying to get the uh, tag team belts from the United Kingdom, Zack Sabre Jr. and uh, Will Ospreay. But they keep um, they keep cheating by getting countouts. So there will be no countouts in the next uh, time they fight. And that shit will not be here. But Knight of Champions is next. And Joey and Wade don't get another chance until Hell in a Cell. Actually, who did this one? Yeah, it's still going to be not until Hell in a Cell. What's I tomorrow? Eh, maybe start around 1 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. If I'm not knocked out or something. I mean, I don't drink or anything like that, so it's not like I'm going to have a hangover, but... Yeah, if I could sleep, yes, I would. I, I fell asleep at 6.10 this morning. I woke up at 9. So. Who knows? Joey. Oh, shit. Look at that match. And that's just a house show. That match also. That match also. <laughs> Might have to change that match and just give the Four Horsemen a chance to uh, take that belt in a house show. That's a good match, too. I don't know who the fuck you're calling out. Oh, shit. That's interesting. Lazar and Executioner are in a rivalry right now. But, uh, shit, I might save this show for tomorrow, too. Started everything off with this. Randa Kane. Oh, for real? So you're waiting for um, 2K19 to make it? Yep, yep. Alright guys, I appreciate you guys coming in, watching. I appreciate the follows, the, um, the hosts, as always. And if you've never been here before, my saying as I go out, uh, please, please, please... Always, always stay safe and be safe. Take care.